This video is long overdue. We need to talk about how a fan evacuates air from the house. My last video on Bernoulli's principle went viral and people were really wondering how the air moves with a fan. So let's talk about a couple things. If you put the fan directly in the window or directly in the door, what happens is that the fan blows the air outside and now you've created a vacuum inside your room and some of this air is simply gonna come back inside. So you're blowing air out and other air is gonna come right back inside. What you need to do is back the fan up from the door or from the window. And then when you turn it on, you feel all around the opening to make sure air is moving out. And this is how firefighters evacuate smoke from a house. Now, the other consideration is what windows do you leave open on the other side of the house? Now, if I leave, I'm in the attic right now, if I leave the front door open, that means that air is gonna travel in the front door throughout the house and then out here. If I'm trying to evacuate the air, if I'm trying to cool down my bedroom at night, I open up a bedroom window or a closet window in the bedroom and it will pull cold air in through the bedroom. If you have more windows and doors open, you'll get a little bit of movement from each place. If you only open one window, you're gonna get movement blowing from that part of the house. If there are rooms that are unused, close those doors. Don't let air come in through those windows and doors and uh, you want a channel for your air to move. Now, the other thing you can do is put the fan outside blowing in, but that's generally not nearly as practical. So don't ever put the fan right in the window unless you have to. And if you have to do that, close the window above the fan so that it's just blowing that air out. The other thing is, if you put it directly in the window, you don't use Bernoulli's principle and you're not pulling in all that extra air. I'm glad you stuck with me because 